This right here is the heart of Innovix. It's where all the electronic components are fabricated or manufactured from, from Uganda to the rest of the world. Joining me to take me through the process of production is the lead product assistant and the head of production at Innovix. Maria, take yes. us through. We are excited to be here. Welcome to Innovex Uganda. This yeah. is our production room and uh, we use these machines to help us in the assembly of our different products. Mm. This is called SMT line, yeah. surface mount technology line. So these are the PCBs? Yeah, these are the PCBs and it is adjusted according to the para PCB parameters. Mm. We load the magazine full of the PCBs, but since this is a demo, we yes. shall just put a few. And it sends the PCBs to the PCB printer. Okay. This is a printer, so in this process we use soda paste. We add the paste into the machine. What this machine does, it puts the solder paste on the copper pads of the PCBs where the components sit. Usually here, sometimes you need to open and check whether the, the stencil is aligning with the board. It's always advised to open and on checking, it is aligned. If it's not aligned, you can do some adjustments using this table, but according to me, it's well aligned, so I will do the print, and it is printed. Yeah, so it comes up to here, and then we pull it out to check the output whether the board is well pasted. You yeah. can see the soda paste mm -hmm. on it. Yeah, yeah. So, so we if it's well pasted, we put it back to the conveyor. Take us to the next process. So the next process is the pick and place machine. Mm. Pick and place. All these are feeders having components of the components that are on the board. So this is our oven, mm. yeah, for drying, for soldering, that's the SMB soldering. From its humble beginnings, Innovex has crossed boundaries to now be known as a Ugandan company that aims to drive the social economic transformation of Africa through the development of new technologies. Innovex is a team of a very passionate Ugandans who have always been interested in creating technology in Africa and selling it to the world. Um, that was, you know, the core, the core reason that brought us together. We noticed that there is not any technology that is sold on the global market that is made in Africa. Innovex is a technology company. Our specialty is Internet of Things technology. Our flagship product is remote. It's an Internet of Things technology that is used for remote monitoring of solar systems and also used for operation and maintenance of solar assets and renewable energy assets, or clean energy assets. Uh, we create our technology ourselves. We create the hardware here locally with the, our local engineers. Uh, we create the software ourselves and we also produce the hardware ourselves. Uh, uh, there's a percentage of production that happens in China because of course it only makes sense for that to happen but we typically make almost everything ourselves in-house. Their expertise includes embedded systems, 
connected devices, web and software development, and wireless communication technologies using the Internet of Things. Now, in designing our hardware, of course, our hardware is an IoT, an electron, IoT electronic device. It consists mainly of a microcontroller and a bunch of sensors that measure electrical parameters like voltage, current, both AC and DC. We also measure various temperatures and a few other parameters depending on the customer's requirements. Um, and then, of course, the other major component of our hardware is a GSM or GPRS modem that uploads the data that the hardware measures to the cloud. Our remote software platform consists of the remote cloud which stores the data that comes from the hardware and we have a portal which our customers, the solar companies, can access and view this data and draw insights about the performance of these solar assets or solar systems. Uh, in producing our hardware, we buy printed circuit boards from China. We design these ourselves, our hardware and team designs these printed circuit boards. We have them fabricated in China and they're brought here so that we can assemble components onto them using these machines in our production facility. So our production team will typically get printed circuit boards, put them through this process where there's paste applied, components are added, they run through the oven, and then you have a, an assembled uh, PCB. And then there will be another process of adding a through hole components, calibration, firmware programming, and finally, testing. Mm. After testing, if product is deemed fit for purpose, then it is shelved and ready to sell to customers. The Internet of Things, or IoT, is a system of interrelated computing devices, mechanical and digital machines, objects, animals or people that are provided with unique identifiers and the ability to transfer data over a network without requiring human to human or human to computer interactions. Now we have two major offerings. One is remote performance monitoring where you can see data from the performance of the solar system and you can use that to do after sales maintenance. But the other, other offering is pay-as-you-go, which allows our customers, the solar companies, to have remote control over the solar system. This enables them to collect payments if they're selling these solar assets or solar systems on uh, higher purchase or credit basis. Uh, some of our customers also do uh, pay-per-use models where they charge the end user for usage and not they're they not charging them to, own, to pay to own the system but rather for their usage. So that ability to remotely control uh, the solar system enables these customers to execute both models, pay as you go and pay per use. The way our technology works is the hardware is installed on a solar system. So any kind of solar system, any kind of solar asset, it could be a, solar, it could be a home solar system, it could be a solar system for a business, it can be a solar water pump, it can be a solar or off-grid cold room. Any, any asset, off, solar off-grid asset that you need to monitor, you install a unit of hardware there. The hardware measures all the useful and important parameters on this solar asset and it uploads them to our cloud, the remote cloud. Uh, the software platform majorly consists of a database which stores the data that comes from the hardware, uh, a hardware interface which communicates with the hardware, and a user interface portal which our customers use to access the data and also access analytics and, and different calculations that we would have done on the, on, the, on the data to give them useful insights about the performance of these solar systems. So the end users themselves also have access to our platform and they can use that remote control ability for whatever they want, which may include being able to switch on or switch off the loads from anywhere in the world. So with our technology, you have remote control over your solar asset from any part of the world for as long as you can connect to the internet.
InnovEx is disrupting the innovation space in Africa with its three interactive product and service sold, namely remote on energy management system that is unlocking the potential of solar businesses. The InnovEx certificate that has engaged over 350 youth since 2015 in practical skills training and the InnovEx store that is enabling access to modern equipment and components for project prototyping and development. So the benefits that we've collected uh, from most of our customers is that solar end users you know, now experience much better after sales service. And how this happens is because you know, at the comfort of their offices in probably Kampala, where many are based, they're able to you know, service someone who is even in Gulu, as far as Gulu, without needing to be on ground. And um, definitely because for the solar companies, remote monitoring and also the pay-go technology reduces the business risk. The end users are able to access large size solar systems with credit, which has not been the case. Innovix entered the market with a self developed IoT solution, Remote, to provide customer service support. It monitors and controls solar PV systems and irrigation systems remotely and supports preventive maintenance and repair activities.